Welcome back, folks. Let me just, sorry, yeah, adjust my microphone. I bet that was not a pleasant sound. That is my bad. <clears throat> anyway. I went ahead and grabbed some of our supplies. I grabbed a couple more cabbages. I uh, filled up our bag with uh, axes, uh, hand axes, doorknob, door hinge, some nails, and rope. I thought I had more rope than two. I really, really did. I do not know why I only have two rope. I swore I had at least four. But, whatever. Um... We want to carpentry. Is that under here? I don't know how to make like uh, there. <clears throat> okay, apparently it just takes two rope to make <clears throat> the uh, log stacks. So I can also use sheet rope though. Hmm. Hold on. Let's make some sheet rope real quick. There should be clothing on the ground in places, I think. I, mean, I would think so, because I mean, I, I've been throwing stuff on the ground and all that. I also had some, uh, you probably saw the, uh... oh, we have sleeping tablets here. Interesting. Anyway, craft sheet rope. All of that. We also had some. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm getting distracted. All of us had a, had a saw to saw the logs, and uh, and all that. So, go ahead and eat another half of this cabbage. We're a little bit hungry now. Ooh, there's a gun case down here with a gun in it. Ooh. All right, let's check a couple more rooms here. This should all just be food. Um, other gloves, military boots. I can't rip any of those. Bedroom should be in here. There we go. Grab sheet rope. Any other stuff here? Okay. Let's try to get one more sheet rope here. Sorry, I was ill-prepared. I should have looked and done this a little bit before we started, but... Fortunately, sometimes you just can't foresee the uh, things that you're going to need to do. Oh, there we go. That's five. We're going to have a spare sheet rope, but that's fine. I don't think I can rip up anything else. Okay. So we're a little overweight, but that's fine. We're going to throw most of the stuff in the van anyway once we're downstairs. Oop. Do, 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 do. Down we go. All right. So like I said previously, we're going to be working on getting up our uh, fortifications for around the gas station today by going to the forest, cutting down trees, and using them to uh, make some stuff. So it is nighttime, which is unfortunate. Well, we got some driving to do anyway, so let's go ahead and throw our stuff into the van here. I'm just going to throw everything inside of it. There we go. Perfect. All right. Also, my water bottle's empty. God damn. Let's, real quick, go back inside. I keep wanting to use the stairs. I don't know what it is about the stairs that, like, draws me to them sometimes, but it just does. Let's see. This one still has water in it. Perfect. And now it's out. How about these? Any water in here? It does. I think the last of that water. Okay.
It's going to take us some time to drive down there. I don't think it's going to take us like four hours to drive down there. I really don't want to start in the dark. So, why don't we go ahead and sit down and we'll stay until 2 a.m. How about that? Okay. Get enough time. Have another cabbage. How's our weight looking? Still going down. Okay. It's rock and roll, folks. Next time we come back here, we'll have a van full of wood and all that. Maybe we can also collect up some zombies and run them all over. That'd be fun. You know, the next turn here should be the one we want to take. We also have that truck down here that we, that our very first original guy had found. Right there. At some point we could come get that. But I don't care about doing it now, so we're not going to worry about it. How close can I get to the forest from here? I guess maybe I just start, like, here? Okay. Alright, we got some zombies coming for us. I'm gonna just reload. I'm using the shotgun right now is perfect because it'll uh, help them get lured to us. Any zombies that are uh, within hearing range, at least. Alright, so, <clears throat> I think I can put uh, kind of a, a wall around this area, right? That's going to be the plan. I can use, like, a gate here, maybe? There's one zombie looking to bash him. I'll keep that out for right now. So, we have a fence here, right? It kind of already goes around the back of this area. I'm gonna finish off this zombie. Here. Did she just go inside the building for some reason? So we have this fence here. We can use this to continue the line out to here. Put a fence here. And then we can kind of go up this way. Until we hit... <clears throat> over here, then we can go up with that to kind of cordon off the, the gas station, right? And that'll help us to uh, secure it so we don't have to worry about zombies being inside of it pretty much ever. Oh, hey there. I didn't see that one crawl through the window, so I want to walk away from them that I can't just be hit in the back. And doing this will also help us reduce our weight so we don't have to worry about carrying so many shotgun shells, right? So we can carry more stuff later on. Knock it off. To the Tommy. All right. It looks like we are relatively clear. Just kill that guy there real quick. Yeah, if we, I was gonna open up the map, but hold on a second. The more time we're wasting killing like one or two zombies here, I think it's gonna be okay. Because uh, that means it's gonna get brighter out the more time we you know, thin the herd right now. Okay, I'm gonna go up into the corner here where it's more more safe. Waking up the map. Okay. 
So yeah, I think uh, there, there's a road that goes up through here. So we can just kind of blockade that off. And then there's a parking lot over here that has a huge fence that we can also use to, to get into that. So that'll kind of be the plan. I think we'll, we'll cordon off this area by doing a fence like this. That way the gas station is kind of its own isolated little area that we can just kind of climb over uh, if we need to from that side or open the gate going into here. Uh, that'll kind of be the, the, the goal. And, and whatnot. So if we look down here, we can see it's a little park, but there's so much wood and stuff that we can get here. I'm going to just scream my head off for a little bit. Hopefully we can see if we can get some zombies coming out and around the area. If not, if we don't see any zombies, we can start getting to work and uh, chopping down some trees. I'm going to take the axe, which is mostly uh, damaged here. We had used it to kill a bunch of guys. All right. We're exhausted. I think that was it for that axe. Was it? No. Never mind. I'm gonna get into the uh, truck here. And can we can we rest at all? Or maybe this counts as resting if I just wait speed up time. Like I did, but we're tired now, of course. That's how that goes. This sucks. We are way too tired to deal with uh, deal with this. Okay, let's hop out. I'm gonna re-equip the baseball bat. Uh, let's get into this house. See if I can use the bed to, to sleep. Luckily, it looks like it's uh, relatively secure. Just clear everything out first. I don't want to get any surprises when we come back down, right? Okay, that room is secure. Bathroom is secure. And this house is secure, all right. What, is, what does this door lead to? A little balcony? Wait, is there another door over here? Oh, that's the... Oh, it's a connected house. I see. Okay. Let's see, sleep, sleep quick. We can use this base. Or not this base. This house is a kind of a forward operating base for our uh, festivities here. Okay. I want to set my alarm for one moment, please, while I do that. So, 1700, let's set it for... Let's go 6 o'clock. And then, anytime we need to, we can just come in here, sleep, and then be woken up in time to go back. So, real quick, before we head on out, let's eat another half of our thing there. Let's go ahead and smoke a cigarette. Perfect. Okay. Close the door so the zombies can't get back into it. These are young trees that I don't want to cut down quite yet. I thought the van like disappeared for a second there when I when I couldn't see the uh, the van, but only the trailer. Is that my axe breaking? It was. Okay. Well, time to get my next one. I think I'll use uh, the hand axes next. I think these can be repaired, so I'm gonna... Give me one of these hand axes. Weapon primary. 
I also found out we can actually make um, our own axes uh, with stone and uh, like tree branches or something, I think it was. You can kind of forage to find that stuff. Right now, the plan is just to clear as much of this as we can, uh, and then we'll gather the logs and stuff afterwards. Yep. We're getting a little tired and everything now. Our attack speed's lower, our increased speed of losing health. That's not good. Let's hop into the van and we can uh, kind of relax for a little while. Oof. Let's take a lunch break. Ah, good old lettuce. Also, I don't know why the lighter uh, didn't go back into my thing there. there we go. That was the quality on the hand axe. Oh, that's good doing all right. Can I uh, remove this bush? I just don't like it. Why did I hear that? Why, why is the fight music here? Huh? Oh, that guy? Can I hit him from here? No. Okay, well, I don't care. I do not like hearing the fight music right now, though. It, uh... Not good. Maybe we kill it with a shotgun. I did see a couple more behind him, too, so... How about this? Let's, let's jump it. I can lure him over here. Get the three of them together. Oh, there was a lot more there. Oh, my God. Gotta reload. I wonder the fight music kicked in. Damn. Yep. We lose up all of them. I'm gonna check this guy's backpack. I don't think it was a good one, but yeah, it's just a full bag. We done? out of the ground. Oh, that's a hat. Okay. Alright, looks like we're done. Back over we go. Time to continue chopping down these trees. Wait, was that the axe breaking? Aw, oh, man. I guess we'll just go till I'm out of axes. And we can go back home and repair them at some point, so. That's a real plumber. I wasn't expecting him to break that quickly. Maybe if I'm more exhausted, it takes more hits so it ruins the durability. I should try to avoid being exhausted, though. So let's head back into here. Wait a little bit. Oh, just saw another zombie over there. That's a little horde, actually. Let's go clear them out. I don't want to have them sneak up behind me. We don't have too many bullets, but stop moving forward. Let's reload. Then let's reload. Come on, man. Oh, look. Conveniently, there's three zombies left. How many zombies can I hit at once? Three. That's right. Excellent. 
it's getting to be nighttime now. Continue cutting down the trees we can while we can. Remove grass, cut down tree. There we go. Shit. Let's head back into the house, and I'm gonna go ahead and just over here. I think we'll just go ahead and take a little rest inside here, eat, do some burpees, then we'll sleep and go back to the house. Cause we gotta be getting to the point where we're tired, right? And how's our uh, stuff looking? Oh yeah, we're losing weight, baby all this manual labor so we're actually tired now which is excellent let's keep up our regularity but continuing to do burpees for basically as long as we can go all right sleep time and hopefully we sleep to the point where our um alarm goes off well That's not ideal. Hmm. Stupid night time. Maybe I should just work until I'm like way more tired, right? Oops, not there. I might as well smoke while we have time. Let's uh, refill our empty water bottle, which apparently just got empty because I didn't see it empty before. What else you got here for food? Cereal? Ugh. No thanks. I'm on a diet. I canned chili, which doesn't have too many calories in it. Also mushroom soup, which is also not too bad. And potato, which is great. So I have a little bit of stuff here. Okay. So hard to see. I'm gonna start clearing out this little area. Hopefully not running into too many problems here. So I like how quickly we just like kill the tree when I fast forward time there. By the way, that is me fast forwarding time in case you were curious. It's not like literally taking one hit to destroy. Okay. I should have a nice little sit in the van for an hour or two here. Let's wait until four. A little longer. Come on. Come on. Come on. You know you want to change. There you go. All right. <clears throat> what is that symbol? Slight wind chill. That's not good. I'm wearing a bunch of stuff. I guess I don't have gloves. I think it'll be fine. Oh, just leveled up. Maintenance? Okay. Take it. The 
straight up deforestation up in this motherfucker, man. So I don't lure in zombies. Not that. I mean, I think if I'm gonna lure in zombies, they would be lured in by the chopping of trees, not a a watch keeping. And it's gone. All right. Um, we do have the the main axe remaining, but I don't think that it's uh, that important to uh, hold on to. Zombies have grouped up there. All right. <clears throat> Let's throw our axe in here. Let's get in the van and get a little rest. Okay. Aw, oh, man, it's stale now. Shit. Well, I get it, I suppose. Also, have a smoke. So at this point, I don't think I should continue cutting. But we're getting to the point where we are running out of stuff, so let's just grab our ropes. Grab one more, thank you. And then I'm going to start grabbing logs. And again, I don't know why my lighter does not go back into the granny pack like everything else does. But uh, whatever. All right. Instead of starting with the closest ones, let's start with the furthest ones. I think that'll work out better for us. But can I just do as I can? Log stack. Here we go. Excellent. I think that was all the rope that I had, no? Okay. Here we got some some four log stacks we can go ahead and grab onto. That'll help reduce their weight, which is excellent. There we go. We're still not in a great position, but fine. I'm just going to store the logs into the trailer for now. and unstack all these logs and I can put them back into here. Excellent. So I can use the, the stacks to transport and then I'll... Uh, you know what? Hold on. I think I'll put this rope back. I think I can handle a couple without, you know, trouble, but I don't want to, you know, too much here. Hold on. Just told me I could. There we go. Crack one. One there. Put that on the ground. Grab these two logs. I can grab that log. Grab that. Put like that. Those two logs and this log. And then well that stack on me, that's fine. Grab another stack here. Which I can then immediately throw into my backpack. Pull it away. And I have two more stacks here, which we'll just put into here. Of course, they all don't go in there, so we'll just grab the stack here. There we go. All right, cool. We can handle four stacks at once of the four stack logs. It's great. Go ahead and unstack all of these. And we'll 
throw the logs into there. We'll just kind of keep repeating this process until we have all the logs cleaned up. There's one log right here. Yep, grab that. Also all the branches and twigs that we want to grab because we can uh, <clears throat> use them. Stuff. Let's craft these. Get around, please. Grab another stack. go. I can grab the three that are on the ground, put them in the backpack, and that'll do that. There we go. Excellent. We're making some real progress now. Although apparently there's 22 logs on the ground here. I don't know how those got there. Did I drop them, maybe? Oh. Apparently that's all that this can hold. Hmm. Let's take the logs out of the uh, back trailer, put them into here, and then I can just do this, this, and then do the same thing. All right. Yeah. At some point we're gonna run out of base for the logs, which is inevitable. What has a little bit more room? If I put all these in here, I think I'll just barely have the space for everything. Okay, cool. Okay, my inventory, I don't have any food left. Let's close that. I don't want to sleep, man. All right, so let's go in here, and there was the potato 160. Chili is that. We'll open up a potato can. We'll go ahead and uh, eat half of it. That'll do that for us. <coughs> Excellent. Okay. Now, if I could just find a uh, some... What is it? Vitamins? What increases my... Not painkiller, not sleeping... Well, I guess I could take sleeping pills and see how much I can sleep here. Hmm. Antibiotics? No, I'll take those. Those are hard to come by. I only have six from the hospital. Okay. Let's sleep, first of all. Well, hold on, actually, before we sleep, let's exercise. Okay. Now, let's sleep. Uh, also, I'm pretty sure our feet can be unbandaged And now. The stitches were already fixed. It's just that they were a little bit scratched after that. So uh, let's go ahead and eat another half the can. There we go, and I'm just going to throw this on the ground, I don't care. Alright, let's take some sleeping tablets. And then while those are kicking in, let's go down and grab another can of potato or whatever we have available. That doesn't cost much. This will be cream of mushroom soup. We can just use a screwdriver to open it, I'll just take the can then. Hell yeah! All right, then, whilst we wait for the sleeping pills to kick in, let's go ahead and do some more exercises. For another hour. Ooh, look at that. We can actually see visible progress go into our strength now. Okay, we're starting to get a little tired. Good. I'm gonna sit on the ground here, though. I'm gonna wait until we're even more tired, like ridiculously tired. Then, <clears throat> we're gonna do as many burpees as we can once more. And now we're gonna sleep. We get that work in out, you know. 
Exhaustion's gone. Still sleeping. We have some exercise fatigue. Came and went, though. That's good. Our alarm still has not gone off. Dang. Why? Why doesn't it want me to wake up? I guess because I have that stupid perk that's like, oh, sleep. You don't need sleep. Hey, we're 88. Nice. All right, well, I don't think we need to sleep or anything right now, so. Go ahead and survey the gas station quick. Good. All right. <clears throat> Get in the van. We're going to move it to the construction site. That's not even a tree. Come on. That's a shrub. Let's be honest. All right. We're going to start here. Go ahead and open up this can. Half. We'll eat half. While surveying the surroundings. Take care of the zombie that's banging away in the store here. Check the rest of the store, make sure that I can't sell you. I can't see shit in there to be honest. Okay. Let's begin. We're gonna need my saw. We're gonna need our nails. And then we're gonna need logs. Four logs, okay. Now let's start by cutting these into planks. Okay, and real quick, carpentry. Start making the wall. Next batch of logs, please and thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and saw them up. I'm gonna put them in my backpack just to hopefully reduce their weight. All right, there's no difference between wall level two and three in terms of what we need to uh, craft it. So we're just gonna do wall four. Side's a little bit safer now. Let's grab the next batch. And you know what? Let's grab the hinges and stuff too. Why not? Let's do that. Oh, let's back away from, from there a little bit. Not drill flank. No, no, stop, stop. He's back into here. Go. All right. I think it might be good to make the double door first. We need it to line up here. Oop. Here. Put it right here. There we go. All right. Now that we have that there, we can do a little more. All right. We just needed 12 for that. I forgot that was... Oh, hey. I wish when I saw them it would put them back into my inventory here. Okay, whatever. 
Carpentry. Wall. Wall frame. Let's go. I had left, god dang. Just real quick survey back here, make sure we're not attracting any zombies in that direction. Luckily, it looks like we uh, managed to saw some planks up beforehand as well, so let's just take those and we will create a wall here. the next batch. Let's go ahead and finish this uh, hand soup off. Throw that on the ground. Um, sleeping tablets, let's go ahead and put them into here. I thought I heard something for a second. Anyway grab the logs, then from the other one, we'll grab the rest of the logs out of here. Maybe I should just saw one at a time so my health doesn't go down. At least for the first couple, right? I can just saw all of them. We're still all right. Out of nails now. Hmm. That's also one concern. Is uh, running out of nails. finished. At least to this side. Come on. Choose one. Coolio. Alright, we just need one more set of logs to finish up that gap and then we can start going on the next side, which, if I remember correctly, we wanted to um, do just right here, so that should be fine. Okay. Saw all. One, two. Carpentry. What was that noise? Y'all hear that? It was like a pig or something squealing. This is what it sounded like. This was like my stomach squelching or something weird like that. All right, this whole section of the gas station here, secure. I do want to check. Yeah, so there's a chain link fence back there. So once we finish up that side of the wall, 
everything will be secure for the gas station. And we just need to go through it one more time, clear it, make sure it's all good to go, and we will be golden. take planks now um and then i'll put the sheet rope in here there we go we are getting hungry but i'm not gonna worry too much about that right now folks let's just do what we can let's get these two here then we can start turning Imagine doing this all the way around the hospital. It might be better if we look for choke points that are uh, going to be easier to fortify. That's what we're gonna. That's what we're gonna do. I believe. Mm, we only have thirteen left, huh? Oops, I'm at the backpack, not the main inventory. Sorry. I'm gonna store one. <clears throat> so I'm gonna store one in there since we can only build with multiples of two. Okay. Let's finish up this wall here. I don't know why you had to go to the outside, but fine. One short, no. Okay. Take a look around. I think we're pretty secure right now. All right. Um, I'm going to have to move the truck anyway, so let's go ahead and do that now rather than later. Do you suppose that there's anything in the gas station that I can eat that doesn't have, like, hella high calories? What do you think? You know, I might take this water bottle and put this empty bottle back. Let's see. That has some calories. How much would this, like, if I drink all of this soda? Okay, it has a little bit. Again, it's not very good, is it? Or soda. Oh, got some vitamins here. Nice. Lower my fatigue a little bit. I think everything else is just junk food, pretty much. In it. <laughs> How is it being like light outside? Even shine in here into this closed off room and make it brighter. Weird how that works, isn't it? Okay, well. Nothing I need in here, so let's go ahead and head back out. We're still a little hungry, but I don't think that's gonna cause us much issue. All right, so now if I get into the van and just try to back up. I just back up in like a straight line, try to keep the trailer straight without jackknifing it. Should be okay. In fact, I can probably just park it back down here. So we're going to be transporting more stuff here in a minute anyway. Go ahead and grab me the, uh, the sheets. Why are these sheets so heavy? That is so bizarre. All right, 
think there was one more uh, mushroom stew in here. I'm gonna grab that, use that as a snack. Because after that, oh no, actually we're done with those. I guess pineapple would be the next best one. I'm gonna take them. And we can use them, I suppose. Anything after that I don't want to use because it might just increase my weight more. And we don't want that. Okay. Let's start here. We need to open up our context menu. Create a stack of logs. Create a stack of logs. Down here, create a stack of logs. Create a stack of logs. All right, let's pick them up now. One. Two. Equip the shotgun in both hands to lighten our load a little bit further. Three. And then the fourth one has to go into our normal inventory. Okay. Then we can go ahead and unstack all the logs that I need to throw into here. Why are logs so heavy? There we go. Alright, we need to eat now, so let's go ahead and open one can of the uh, pineapple. Half. Go. I suppose I could eat more and get that like carry bonus, but I don't really wanna. Right. Continue. I'm gonna have to pick up these two logs here. I can create a stack here, which I can then put in my backpack that up. And I can come over to here and come on, I said craft all. There we go. Boop. And one more, huh? Hmm. Give me that log. go. I'm just going to unstack them a little bit at a time so I'm not taking so much damage. Oh, that's full now? Okay. Apparently I can only hold six logs in my inventory before I have to like, shit myself or something. I don't know. Now let's eat this other half because we are still hungry. Okay. Ugh. I don't know how much more I can actually carry of this stuff. Two more logs. Let's grab those. There's one more straggler down here. Go ahead and do this. That. I can pick that up. Like so. Grab these two logs. Combine them into a stack here. Oh, that's four. Okay. I don't know why I went to the back of the van, like, it could hold more, but it can't. Hmm. I don't think we can stack too much more in here. Yeah, that's about it. Okay. That's all. Let's go ahead and close that then.
Why does the car not like to start? It has a perfect condition uh, engine, blah, blah, engine, pretty much. I don't get it. Okay. Go ahead and unstack these logs. And let's go ahead and cut them all up. We're also going to need some more nails, so let's grab them out of the back here. Open box of nails. There we go. Alrighty. It's time to fortify more. Now, I could put another gate here, but I don't really want to. So that's why we're not doing it. Give me one of these planks and fill the rest up with logs here. I don't know how I'm not taking damage. Maybe it's just not showing me the graphical shaking of the heart over there. Give me four. There we go. All right. Uh, toss this can of emptiness on the ground. Let's open up the next one. Go ahead and eat half the can because we are hungry. There we go. All right. Back the logs. Let's start back down here. Saw planks. One. Am I gonna have to jump through it? Yeah, it's gonna make me jump through it. All logs one. I'm trying to not put too much burden on my guy's body here. I don't think it's gonna be very possible. Hey, Carpentry leveled up. What is it up to now, Max? Nah. One more level for that. Nice. Okay. We are getting really tired, though, so let's go ahead and head down to the uh, house. Take a nice little nap and I guess wake up in the fucking middle of the night, because that's how that seems to be going. Alright, before we do that though, do our burpees. There we go. And now sleep time. Love to see it. Okay. Well, let's uh, let's smoke to waste some time and to lower the anxiety, of course, not just. Why do I feel like I'm like so overweight? I think that's the last of that can. Yep. Yep. You know what? Let's wait until, like, three. Maybe four, fuck it. Okay. Still losing weight. What other cooked goods do they have here? Oh, they had some stuff on the counter. Oh, sardines, perfect. Those barely do anything. In terms of calorie. And then... Had evaporated milk, which we're not doing. We could do chili, because that's only, what, 200 or something? Start with a can, uh, 
sardines though. I think maybe we put the shotgun in the truck. If I can get to it, there we go. Or did I already? I forgot. I did not. Right, let's put it in here. That'll uh, free up some space for us. The shotgun shells in it as well. Because we don't really need them when uh, we're doing this. So let's grab this stuff. There we go. Screw it, just saw them all. Yep. Next batch. very many um, things left here. Nails, I'm talking. Let's do what we can, though. I'll we'll have to go back home and get some more. We also need food anyway, so it'd probably be a good time to go back, huh? Open up a can of chili. Oh, we already have the sardines open, I forgot. I eat the rest of those. Put the can on the ground here. Put the lighter back into my damn pocket. Alright. Let's, uh, I don't even need to do it. Let's just unstack the logs. Go ahead and saw them all down. The escape rope in there. All right. Carpentry, wall, wooden pillar, frame, whatever. All right. I just need to grab one more log. We can finish off the nails we have there. Those require more nails, okay. All right. Well, although we do not have a full uh, wall yet, it has been coming along. We got this area nice and cordoned off, so that's good. Um. You know how I was saying that maybe we should, like, try to do this everywhere? Like, put a whole wall around Louisville? Yeah, we aren't going to do that. That, uh, that is not something we're going to do. I was going to go open the gate and then drive through it, but we have a huge open area here that we can just drive through. If the car decides to start... Let's head home, grab more nails. We can finish securing the gas station. That's a lot of zombies down there. I'm not afraid of them, though. Pain, extra sensitivity. 
see. Yeah. It just goes into the hospital, so that's fine. Hmm. Got some automatic gunfire. One of those random event things. Alright. Off you go. I'm gonna check to see if, uh, I know I have some broken stuff we can bring in with me. Uh, the sleeping pills I guess I can take. Anything in the trunk of this one? Just the sheet rope. Well, I might as well take the actual normal rope too, since that can't be used right now. I'll take these planks upstairs. Might as well. Have a little extra planks here, rather than have to go to the forest all the time to get them. All right. We are making some real goals with our fitness journey here, ladies and gentlemen. Um, also, before we go in there, let's check a look at our crops. Hello, my friends. I'm here to see you. Seed bearing tomatoes. Hell yeah, let's harvest them. I think those are also seed bearing radishes there. Oh, hold on. We're getting a little overweight now. Here we go. Alright, let's eat one of our tomatoes. We need a whole one just to really do it there. Alright, and these are seed bearing. Yep, yeah, okay. Let's drop off what we're carrying, then we can come back up and trowel and replant stuff. Also, we learned uh, max farming there, so we'll have to read our next farming book if we have one. I don't know if we do or not. Okay. Damn. Some of it went stale already. Alright, we got a full freezer full of... This isn't running. <laughs> Boy, generator. Why the hell are you off? fuel. Fine, turn it on. Alright. Now that that's back, hopefully our stuff does not stay bad. Let's check on our wood area here. Throw these planks in there. One, two, three, four, five, Just grab that many for now. And the box of nails out of here. Cool. All right. Oh, we need to drop off the stuff down there as well. Sleeping tablets antibiotics we picked up can go into here. Also, speaking of, let's go ahead and unbandage our uh, feet. Those are fine now. Go grab for them. Alright. Uh, actually, you know what? Let me put I'm going to put these in the backpack. 
We'll carry him downstairs. Um. Now we have these broken axes, which I'm just going to throw into here. For now. Of course, that one doesn't want to fit. Why would it fit? No, I'll throw it into the other side. There we go. I'm going to throw this stale cabbage just on the ground here. There we go. And then the uh, rope go into there. Cool. Then the only thing I have left here is the empty bottle and these vitamins. Four. All right, cool. Let's drink. Fill all of our bottles. Excellent. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to go ahead and just wrap things up here for right now. Um, luckily, we came back and discovered that the fridge wasn't... Uh, wasn't working, because if that uh, would have lasted a little bit longer, we would have lost all of our produce, which would have been bad. So we have to keep an eye on that. We have 20 days now, though, so uh, about a month, so that's good. Um, yeah. Okay. So I think what I'll do here, uh, off screen and whatnot, I'll go ahead and replant tomatoes, harvest the radishes, since we have, uh, have to read our Farming 3 book, right? Yeah, it's Farming 3. Let's grab that right now. I should also transcribe since we learned some new stuff here. There we go. Our skills are really fleshing out. We should have carpentry to the next level and the highest level in just a moment. But we'll see. Ugh. All right, so when we come back, um, I'm just going to end my own time off screen, completely isolate the uh, gas station. So when we come back, I'll show you that finished and done. Hopefully I do not die or anything uh, during the time, because that would be just depressing. Um, although I'm not going to accidentally fall out of a window, so I should be okay. But I will bring some more shotgun shells with me as well, though. And then once we get the gas station secure, we can start looking at the little choke points for the hospital uh, to determine where we want to close it off. The first easiest one to look at would be the top where uh, that like fence kind of narrows. I got a bottleneck along the road. We can just put a nice little thing across that and cap that off just perfectly. Um, after that, we'll have to look. So until next time, everyone. Bye for now.